Carlos Newton set to enter the world famous octagon once again. Carlos Newton is an extremely talented jujitsu black belt. He has competed against the best in the world, both in Pride and here in the Octagon. He beat Pat Militich for the welterweight title, and if Carlos Newton gets a fight to the ground, he is dangerous. Carlos Newton, ready to throw down and put on a show. Making his way to the world-famous octagon. Phil Baroni has always been a very aggressive fighter. He likes to take the center of the cage and trade shots, and we've seen on many occasions that he has some big knockout power in his hands. Phil Baroni, fired up and ready to go. Tale of the Tape is brought to you by UFC Store. The sport lives here. And now with our official introductions, Bruce Buffer. And now, five rounds for the UFC Walter Waite Championship of the World. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner. This man is a Dragon Ball Jiu-Jitsu fighter. He stands five feet, nine inches tall. Weighing in at 170 pounds, fighting out of New Market, Ontario, Canada. He is the former UFC welterweight champion, Carlos the Ronin Newton. And now, fighting out of the red corner, this man is a boxer and a wrestler. He stands five feet nine inches tall, weighing in at 170 pounds. Fighting out of Long Island and New York, the New York Badass, Bill Maroney! And when the action begins, our referee in charge of this contest is Dan Mergliata. All right, guys, this is for the UFC Championship. I want a nice, clean fight. I want you to obey my commands at all times. Protect yourself at all times. Touch gloves. Come on out fighting. Back to your commands. Mike Goldberg with Joe Rogan, and we are ready to start round one. Are you ready? Are you ready? Carlos Newton, Phil Baroni, and we are Let's go underway. Nice body shot and then hook combination. Stopped. Over the top. Just punishing him. Got him clinched up against the fence. Man, they're pummeling back and forth. It's hard to see who has the edge here. And nicely done. Trips him right down. Okay, moves into the mount here. Under oh, we got reversed. Oh, beautiful hook! Joe looking for the takedown here. Nice sprawl, good takedown defense. remains in round number one. That one dropped him. He's hurt. He's hurt. I can't believe he got back to his feet, but he has hurt badly. What an exchange here. Oh, another one. Under 90 seconds remains in round one. And now he's answered. Nice right hand. Oh, answered by a big body shot. Just about one minute remains in the first round. And oh, he answers. 
45 seconds remains in the first round. Oh, they're just throwing. Oh, they're exchanging here. Oh, ducking in and counters that nicely. Again, the takedown is stuffed. Our first round is in the books. Both fighters showing some pretty effective stand-up striking, Joe. Yeah, they seem to have no interest in going to the ground. So after you throw a couple punches, you got to come up with the uppercut. Back them up. Back them up. Off timing. Three, two. Three, two. He's looking for that uppercut. Work out those punches. Remember, defense and offense at the same time. Okay? But that offense cut that angle. Split that offense. Cut that angle. Put that offense. Let's take a look at the replay, Mike. Some beautiful counter fighting on display. Here we see a slip straight into a vicious counter strike. And some incredible power on that shot here. Just connected perfectly. Some good striking in that round, Mike. You've got to stay on balance. You've got to keep moving forward while you're punching. And you can't stop in one play. The beautiful Ariani. Are you ready? Are you ready? We start round two. Go, this Let's fight fight's scheduled for five. Five-minute rounds. No, 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 good no, no, takedown defense. Got to take down, defense. Take down again. Pushes him off of the feet. And another takedown. Beautiful. Push away and get back to your feet. Side control. He's got half guard. Oh, reversal. And he's got he's side, side control. control. Oh, nice knee. And into full mount. Control his hands. Work that wrist control. Big right hand. Baroni is bleeding. Hands up. Stay tight in there. Right on the oh! Hands up. Keep it out. Oh, he gets reversed. Over under control. Three minutes remains in the second round. Reversed. Transitions to the full mount. Oh, we got reversed. He's inside control here. He's got the full mount. Reversal. Let's go, push it now into side control. And those are knockout punches, Joe. Vicious punches from the top, Mike. Okay. One minute remains in round two. Flipped him over. Boom. 30 seconds remains in the round. Control his hands. We got 20 seconds. Half guard. He's in full guard. Side control again. Wow, that right, right hand. Stop. Two right. rounds in the books. Three rounds to go in this UFC title fight. Man, they really mixed it up in that round, Joe. Yeah, both these guys are very well-rounded, and they had a chance to show it in there. All right, all right. Ready to go. Start to finish. Hey, you're never against the cage. You turn him, I want you to kneel and dig into the body. He sets up, you get hands in his face fast. Fast. All right, hard hands in his face. Do not let him sit up. You miss it. All right, let's go to the replay, Mike. Very nice takedown here. And here's that lightning fast takedown. Amazing wrestling technique. A lot of versatility being shown in that round, Mike. You're going back to the strikes. You're looking for... The beautiful Shandella gets us set for round three.
and we are set for the start of round three. This is a championship fight, so it is scheduled for five five-minute rounds. Good sprawl. Joe, let's see what he chooses to do. He's looking for Doma Plata here. He's got the arm isolated. Oh, he's got it, Mike. That's a bad position for your shoulder right there. Oh, man, he's got it. It's over. He got the tap. Yes, he did. All over. Perfectly executed submission victory. Great job done here tonight. We have a new UFC welterweight champion. Let's take a look at it again. As soon as he gets up high like that, Mike, he's twisting that shoulder to a very unnatural angle, forcing the tap. Man, he was cranking on that limb. Yeah, that was a really nice technique there to get the omoplata. The veteran voice of the octagon, Bruce Buffer has the official decision. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Dan Mergliata has called a stop to this contest at 59 seconds of the third round. Declaring the winner by tap out due to an omoplata. And now, the new UFC welterweight champion of the world, Carlos the Ronin Newtown. Carlos Newton is the new UFC welterweight champion.